or serious there. Well, hey, one holiday tradition that is not being affected by the pandemic is the NORAD Santa Tracker. Meteorologist Kristen Curry explores why the military department has taken on this important task. What started back in 1955 as an accidental call by a child looking for Santa Claus is now one of the most highly anticipated holiday traditions for families all over the world. The NORAD Santa Tracker. Over 60 years ago, a call came into the Continental Air Defense Command Operations Center in Colorado Springs, Colorado. An Air Force colonel on duty that night answered the call only to realize that the person on the other end of the line was someone who probably shouldn't have had that unlisted government number. A young child had dialed the number thinking she was calling Santa after seeing a promotion in the local newspaper. The colonel quickly realized the mistake, but assured her that the command center would make sure Santa had a safe journey from the North Pole. Thus, a tradition was born, and three years later became a responsibility of the North American Aerospace Defense Command. Tracking anything and everything that flies in and around North America, NORAD operates 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. But one day out of every year, a special mission occurs. The mission? Tracking Santa Claus on Christmas Eve. The Department of Defense's NORAD Santa Tracker website follows Santa's sleigh all night, updating his location and the number of delivered gifts each minute. The effort is made possible by numerous volunteers and generous donations. Each year, nearly 15 million unique visitors from over 200 countries and territories visit the website, while the hotline can receive over 130,000 calls. So come this Christmas Eve, all eyes will be on the skies for the man in the big red suit. Making his way across the globe, pulled by his nine famous reindeer and protected by the men and women of the United States Department of Defense.